So I just came back from the grocery store and I just want to know who took all the toilet paper. Because now I have to wipe my <coughs> with this. We be rising every day. I just came back from a food haul. This is just typically what I eat every week. What I'm eating, you know, for this coronavirus period, the flu season, the, this is really what I eat all the time, just to keep my immune system up, just to keep my body clean and, uh, and get, you know, take mucus out. Um, and, you know, with, even with what we look at heart disease, I believe there's 700,000 people that die of cardiovascular disease, heart attack, stroke. So this is what I eat to keep my blood clean, to keep my blood flowing. Of course, right in the front here, we got apples. Apples are really good for cleaning out the colon. Lemons, these are a must for making my lemonade with some maple syrup. Uh, one of my favorites for taking out mucus and hydrating the body. I love lemons. Of course, we got some bananas because I like to make berry banana smoothies. And if you guys don't know, once the, once the bananas become ripe, like these ones, uh, sometimes I will bake with them or I will freeze them. And one of my favorites right now, mangoes. These are high protein. Uh, really good for also cleaning out your body, cleaning out mucus. All of these fruits are the best for keeping your body clean. You guys know grapes are one of my favorites. I love grapes. This, um, this fruit right here, packed with resveratrol, which is an antioxidant, so really good for your heart, for cardiovascular disease and uh, also for taking out ovarian cysts, which I had, and now they're gone. Awesome. <laughs> uh, we got some oranges back here, some grapefruit, really good mucus pullers as well. Takes out congestion, uh, any sort of, if you have blocked sinuses, oranges, grapefruit, the lemons, those get that mucus and congestion, it pulls it right out. So you, after you may have some of those, you may just be sneezing, that's good. You wanna get that out. And then I have some cabbage here, which I've really been enjoying. I've been making some cabbage rolls, which you guys follow me on Instagram, you'll be, be seeing that. And I have a recipe book coming out very, very soon. So I'll show you guys all my recipes and what I do with all these foods to make um, healthy, healthy whole foods. I got some onions here because I love to make some soups. Uh, you know, some stir fries, those are always my favorite, with some celery, sometimes I'll do celery juice. And then what we have here, which I'll hold up, is some greens. Now greens are really good for keeping the body clean, alkalized, and high in minerals. So high in calcium and magnesium. Magnesium is especially important for keeping you calm right now. And uh, for those that have anxiety, it's a really good mineral to have. But uh, in whole, I like whole form. So a lot of people are, are uh, I see grabbing all the vitamins off the shelves. But this is where I like to get my vitamins and minerals from the whole foods that are not isolated. But what I love about the salads is I make, uh, you know, throw some tomatoes on there, maybe some uh, cucumber. Uh, I love. Also, garlic. Garlic is really good uh, if you're wanting to get out yeast, um, any sort of uh, bacteria. Onions are also good uh, for that as well. And uh, over here, I have some carrots. Again, those are for making uh, some soups. I have dates for my smoothies. Hemp seeds, high in protein. I throw those in my smoothies as well. And then I got my berries. So these are frozen strawberries and wild blueberries. So those are really good 
for keeping your body hydrated, bumping up the flavonoids and antioxidants, which is what you want during this time to keep your immune system up. Now, when I make my soups, I, uh, you know, throw some legumes in there. I got some lentils, some yellow peas, split peas. Um, so you guys will see the recipes I'm making with all of these good foods. And I got some veggie broth. Also have some herbal tea for, from the Herbal Health Club. Now, I also have some oregano up there, which is really good. So if you're wanting to detox any sort of viruses, Epstein-Barr virus, you want to start looking at getting in the herbs, some herbal teas uh, and some oregano and some of a variety of herbs. I got this herbal, this is the Heal All Tea, which has a number of great herbs in there, plantain, burdock, marshmallow root, comfrey leaf. These herbs are amazing because they're tissue specific, so they really start to wake up glands and look at uh, regeneration of tissue that may have been damaged from diet and lifestyle and maybe just environment. There's a lot of toxins out in the environment. So we really have to protect our bodies and alkalize, hydrate, and feed our body whole foods. Uh, so I do that, but I also have here, I'm, I'm <laughs> growing some, I got some lemon balm. Now lemon balm is really good too uh, for things like viruses. Lemon balm, thyme, oregano, garlic, elderberries. Uh, there's you know lots of great herbs out there for detoxification and regeneration. And down here, this is my, <laughs> this is what I carry my groceries in. <laughs> Nice. I'm trying to reduce my plastic too, so I got a big bag of rice. Rice is always good to throw in soup, as well as I got some potatoes. So I got sweet potatoes, yellow potatoes. Those I like to just make my own fries and um, put in soups. And of course I have other stuff here, like I do have some oats, um, but this is what I pretty much eat every week and this is my usual so I'm not panic buying here I'm just buying what I need and what I use and uh, it's keeping me I just feel good eating this and I feel clean and it just feels like my body is got a good flow to it good blood flow so um, I thought I would just share that all out with you guys today to show you guys what I typically eat and uh, what I ate this is pretty much what I ate for healing my body healing and taking out ovarian cysts and endometriosis and bowel problems. So I really brought in whole foods, a lot of fruits, a lot of soups, and um, just a variety of getting in vitamins and minerals and you know just keeping my body flowing, clean, alkalized, and hydrated and oxygenated. All these foods are high water content, right? So they have a lot of oxygen in there really good for taking out mucus, viruses, parasites. And this is where it's at, you guys. This is nature, this is mother nature. And thank you so much for watching. If you guys like these videos, give it a thumbs up and stay tuned for my recipe book that's coming out soon. <laughs> and uh, many blessings to you guys, I hope. I wish you nothing but the best, lots of health and happiness and joy. And you know what? Do something that brings you happiness today, whether that's just buying yourself some flowers. That really just brings up the mood. Turning on some good music, that will just bring you up the mood too. And do something that you love and that makes you happy. When we do that and we all do that, we'll all be rising. <laughs>